Hello, my name is Rontaris and welcome to a new episode of My Time in Porsche. In this episode, we are going back on a tutorial I made quite a while ago. But I think I can explain it faster and better now. This uh, small tutorial is all about the civil furnace. Uh, a lot of questions uh, have been asked. How do I get the civil furnace? And as you can see, I can already build it and uh, yeah if you're just playing the game it's kind of hard to understand where or how to get it uh, how do we get it there are two parts the first part is the abandoned ruins one or abandoned ruins two it just doesn't matter which one you use and the thing you need to get there is the data disks Data discs are one of the most important things in the game. So to mine them, you can only find them by mining stuff. And uh, that is what we are going to do. For this tutorial, I've picked the Hazard Rune 2. If you are a little bit lower in level than me, then you should go for the Abandoned Rune 1. But I need a lot of stuff that's in this one, so I'm going in this one you got to pay a weekly fee but if you're a little bit in the storyline i think you already paid a fee once you're in the ruins you can fly a little bit inside the ruins find a nice little spot and press the f button and as you can see you find all kind of yellow dots and once you stay on them for a little while they are getting marked so I don't want to die mine all the way down press the escape button pick up your mine mining pickaxe and go right down as you can see I collect a lot of iron ore lead tin a lot of stuff and sometime you are lucky Oh, I digged a little bit too far. Sometimes you're lucky and you will find uh, data disks not in a box but just by mining. But most of the times you find them by mining and finding these boxes. Once you've got one, try and find a new close one like that one. And we are going to mine to that one. And for the simple furnace, you need five data disks. So, yeah, we are going to mine a little bit. Sometimes you're going to find some other stuff that you don't need. But in the end, you need all the stuff you find in here. So don't throw it away. Keep it. So we are going to mine. Until we get some data disks and then we are going to part two of this tutorial. As you can see I also find data disk by just mining. So once you're done mining get out of the mine and make sure it's before six o'clock because when you're too late the next spot will be closed. The next spot we are heading for is the research center and that's where you find my favorite character. And here you find Petra. Petra will be able you will be able to give her research discs and always start with the small ones and once you get through the small ones work your way up. Give her five data discs and uh, she will tell you a little story. You can speed it up by giving her more data disc and I guess I am going to do that this time but you don't have to do that normally you get in a few days you get in one day you get a 
letter how long it's going to take before she finds you a new schematic. And the first schematic you will get is the Civil Furnace. So, now the only thing you need to do to get the Civil Furnace is wait a few days and you will get it in the mail. So, if you are new to this game, uh, do this as early as possible. Because the earlier you start, the better it is. And uh, as it takes some day before you get the schematics, uh, yeah, you get the picture, you need to wait longer and longer. So if you're further in the game and you need a silver furnace like I did, it's already too late. You need to have the schematic before that and you will be able to get the schematic before that. So now the only thing you have to do is wait and you get schematics and then you can build it. And uh, yeah, once you build it, you only need some bronze plates which I'm going to craft now because I want a civil furnace a marble, marble planks marble planks and that one is also from that machine but lucky I got some already made because I got a really quite some stock and the last thing you need is uh, how do you call that thing the stone stool and anyone should be able to craft that one so if you enjoyed this episode or this tutorial give some thumbs up if you're new to the channel and like to get some achievement i already did a few uh, achievement runs some pretty rare ones like the master of the cross you will see the link in the description popping up now and uh, at the end of this video you will also see the list to all my playthroughs of my time at Porsche. I hope you enjoyed this. If you want to see more, push the subscribe button, push the little bell. And uh, if you got any questions, leave them in the comment down below. And if you got anything to say, also leave it in the comment down below. I really enjoyed reading your comment. So, see you all in the next my time at Porsche.